Where do you spend your money when beginning your D&D journey? Should it be on the PHB? There's plenty of starter sets to go at. Or just use the free online quick rules and get yourself a module. I'm going to show you the option that might be right under your nose. So there's the original starter set, there's the essentials kit, there's a Stranger Things one, I'm not counting that. There's Rick and Morty, I'm not counting that. There's the updated starter set. I'm talking about these three. The original set has a very good short campaign, pre-made characters, quick rules and dice. The Essentials Kit adds a DM screen, a more expanded rules to include character building from scratch and therefore blank character sheets and sidekick side rules. The map and the cards is also another great addition. The campaign itself is a series of side quests with the dragon quite literally looming somewhere overhead. Stormwreck Isle has no DM screen, pre-made character sheets, quick rules and a solid short adventure on its own island. So weirdly the second box has a map of Fandlin which is the first adventure and the second adventure. It seems like an afterthought. Each box is about £20 and that is a bargain. For whichever one you get, you get a good handful of stuff. Although I've said before that you get the most bang for your buck with simply the essentials kit. But that's not what I'm saying here. The ultimate starter set is this box. £60 for all three. Now you have your DM screen, you have an adventure, which is regarded as a fantastic starter set, The Lost Minds. The essentials kit one, Dragons of Ice by a Peak, is surrounding Phandalin in the Sword Coast. You have a map of the Sword Coast. You have a map of Phandalin. These are invaluable. The dice, the character sheets of pre-made, all make your own. Sidekicks if you're a small party. Then once they've done the Phandalin quests, they rest, they go away almost on a r relaxation holiday. Boom, dragons of Stormwreck Isle. That's the next mission. Or you can do it in a different order. You're almost paying 60 pounds for the new books. The books have gone up. So I say 60 pounds for all those three, absolute bargain. And then, after, after you've done the, the Fandelver quests, there's the new book, Fandelver and Below, The Shattered Obelisk. This expands the adventure up to level 12. With this purchase, you've got a game for months. And then you've got the new Fandelver book. Now I've already done Stormwreck Isle DM prep videos, and I will be doing Lost Minds of Fandelver and Dragons of Ice Spire Peak at some point. That's just my view anyway, sound off in the comments, and maybe watch this video next.